Hey guys, it's Project Slammy, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Silver. And you can basically get Rock Smash from this guy, or if you catch Sudowoodo over here, you automatically have Rock Smash. Why am I telling you this? Because you need this to advance in Ekertaik City, and basically if you don't get it, you're screwed. Now, I got really screwed up with this just a few minutes ago because I forgot that um, Rock Smash was a TM in the older games, so I was like, shit, where the hell do I get it? And I couldn't remember that you got it from that guy, but I actually, I didn't talk to him because I was too lazy to, and yeah, so I just took my Sudowoodo out, and I'm gonna use Rock Smash. Pokemon, maybe. Didn't I get him? Wait. Hold up. Sudowoodo! Move. Oh, pssst, and it was Rock Throw. Okay, I'm an idiot. Okay, guys, hold on. Guys. Ooh. Okay, guys, word of advice. Do not take my advice. Because I am stupid. And I just wasted so much of my time having to go back and get Rock Smash to teach the Sudowoodo, which I thought he already knew. But, uh, hey guys, anyway. Um, so yeah, that's basically what I did. Um, another th ooh, shit, sorry. Another thing I should mention, um, I accidentally lost the rival fight. Long story short, uh, the <laughs> shirt, short, YouTube screwed me over. I don't have, um, an unlimited time limit anymore for some reason, even though it's telling me I do but it will reject any video that's over 15 minutes, so I had to cut down uh, the video. So I took out the rival fight, and I'm like, okay, well it's a good thing I saved my state so before I fought him, so I don't, you know, just as, you know, insurance, <laughs> as NCS would say. But, somehow, everything got saved over. And so I lost the rival fight. I don't have it anymore. I can't show it. But basically, all I did was make fun of how his uh, Quilava had red eyes and how it was apparently high and everything. But I basically shit all over him, as usual, so he didn't miss anything. And I'm sorry if my gameplay is a little off. My cat is literally sitting on my keyboard, so I'm... This is like Let's Playing at a... Um, Olympic level. Anybody who less plays and has a cat can realize how annoying they can be and how she always wants to be in a- oh my god, why is he gray? Has he always been gray? No, he couldn't have always been gray, aren't- don't, don't they usually have like blue or red shirts or some shit? Okay, well anyway, if you come over here, I forget what this is, but it's something. I'm very insightful. I may as well be a walking guide for this game. And let's come back over here. Okay, guys, we're back. And oh my god, my cat is just now decides to flip all over the place and rub up against my hand. Hey, Butters, what are you doing, Butters? This is my cat, Butters, by the way. She's just an attention whore. She, all she wants to do is be next to me and be the center of attention 24-7. But yeah, so, guys, this video is going to be like at least 14 minutes long. I'll do what I can. But, there's stone. Entei. Oh, wait, no, that's Entei. Shit. Riku's on the right. Riku, wow. Raikou. Okay, yeah, and they just run away because they're afraid of you. And let's get back up there. Hopefully no random battles. Yay! Let's see if this girl saw anything. How did they run through the walls? Three big Pokemon ran off. Okay, cool. Cool beans. I doubt I will have the skill or luck to catch any of them. But, yeah, so let's head over to the gym. Let's get some shit done. In the gy Actually, shit. Fuck. Fuck. I forgot. Okay. Okay. We need a battle plan. Actually, ooh, MVP. MVP, this might be your place. I don't know. 
Guys, I'm either gonna get fucked over in this gym, or I'm either gonna have MVP just shit on everybody. Cause this gym can be pretty difficult sometimes. Like, if you don't have the right Pokemon, good move sets, like, you're basically fucked, but this gym can be pretty annoying. But it it's not really that bad, cause Ghastly has a shitty defense. I can't remember, please hit, thank god. Yeah, Ghastly has like a pitiful defense. But the thing is about Gengar is it's not like, you know, the final evolution. It's not, um, it's not really meant to last long in battles. It's really meant for like a hit and run. So they have devastating speed when raised right and they have devastating special attack. But their defense will always be shit. No matter how much you EV train it or anything, it will always be a piece of shit in regards to defense. But... That's why Gengar is such a good Pokemon. He just goes in there and hopefully one-shots peep things. Oh no, I hate this move. I hate this move. I hate Curse. Well, when Ghost Pokemon are using it. I just... I don't like it. Ghastly! Okay. This is really boring fight. Come on. Come on. There was something else I was supposed to talk about. Oh yeah, notice how it's not lagging anymore? It took me eight months to realize how to keep it from lagging. Oh shit. Fuck. My. Life. I, I should have switched out when I had the chance. Now MVP's gonna die. Great. But yeah, so it's not lagging anymore because I figured out how to keep it from lagging. Yay! Yay! Go me. I'm sorry guys, I'm just not a computer genius at all. And I'm still new to Let's Playing. I mean, technically I've been doing it for like 8 months now, but honestly I only have- this is my 17th episode and I've only done 2 LPs. So I'm still- I'm still learning the tricks and I don't know, I don't care. You know, you don't have to be a computer genius to, you know, like doing this. It's just you gotta- you just gotta have fun doing it. That's- that is the number one rule. It's not quality or your knowledge of the game. Just have fun. Nobody gives a shit. Oh shit, I should have. Oh, wait, I can't switch out. Oh fuck, I forgot about that. Please, MVP, you can make it. No. No. Oh, damn it. Okay, this thing's going down. Who should I pick? You know what? Naked. Naked, this is your fight. Naked, this is your fight. By the way, guys, sorry if you saw my mouse before in the beginning of the video. I was just stupid and I forgot about it. But, um... Oh, another thing. Fuzzy Dude 64 actually asked me to get Gengar as one of my team members, but I don't really want to use Gengar. And I'll be right back, guys. Actually, nah, never mind. Um... But I don't really want to use Gengar only because I don't know how to get him with, with an emulator. I mean, like, I don't know how to trade him because Haunter evolves via trade. And by the way, guys, this is how you get through here. It's kind of like a snake. It, I don't know. It's kind of weird how it's laid out. It's, it's kind of hard to explain, but just watch the way I do it. Like, there's pits. Basically an invisible floor. Even though it just looks like one big black emo floor, but... Yeah, it's a bit difficult. So, what happened today? Well, I cut my finger really bad for work. And only I would really do that because I wasn't paying attention at all. Like, at all. I was just cutting up a cucumber, and you fucking dick. Oh, okay. It was only three, so. That's my spam move. It's my spam move, you douche, but yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, but anyway. So, I had to wear a band-aid all night on my finger, because it's, it's not really a big cut, but it's really deep, and I couldn't stop the bleeding. My boyfriend actually wanted me to go to the emergency room, but I'm like, no. 
no, I'm not going to the emergency room because of me being an idiot. And not only that, I don't want to spend freaking like four hours in the emergency room for a friggin' cut, so whatever. But it's fine now. But I had to wear like this bright, brightly colored band aid all night. I had a blue one and I had a yellow one, so it matched my channel, I guess. But, uh, man. It was just like, ugh. It still, it hurts, but, I don't know. It was actually, it was more like a stab. Like, my my finger's kind of fucked up from it. Like, it, look, it looks like I tried to perform surgery on my own finger. Because, like, I did, like, this... I stabbed it, and then, like, I moved it, and it cut through more of my skin. And, I don't know. It's hard to explain what happened, but... But I basically butchered my hand today. Yeah, it sounds like an awesome day. And I'm sorry this is going to be a late upload. It's just so irritable today this morning like I I like I mentioned in a video on bipolar and like some days I'm just like blah, blah, blah. you know like I have no motivation to get out of bed or get out of my Pokemon blanket or anything I just want to lay down and just be a mopey bitch and uh, oops oops shit whoopsie daisies okay I forgot. This is what you had to do. My bad. Yeah, it like snakes out. And I spent the spring with my Pokemon. Ooh, spring break. Summer, fall, winter. Then spring came again. We have lived together for a long time. Well, your Pokemon are dead, so... And you're like 80, so... Oh, fuck. I got, I got some leveling up to do for this next fight. And you know what? Maybe I'll evolve my Eevee before the next fight. This is gonna be the last battle of the video. Honestly. And, ugh. I don't know. I, I'm just... I don't feel like myself today. I really don't. I just... I'm very, like... I'm just... I'm not very boppy. Like, I'm usually very, like, happy and positive, but, like, well, that's how I've been for the past week. At least, like, I, I have rapid cycling bipolar, so I kind of, like, it, it can be anyway from anywhere from, like, a day of, like, a depressive cycle or a week or a month. Longest a month, but that's really it. And, yeah. But, um... What was I gonna talk about? Maybe I'll just get out of this gym and... Shit, I forgot what I was gonna talk about. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Um... Okay, okay. So guys, I'm gonna leave this off here, and as I heal my Pokemon, I just want you guys to know that I am posting a review- Where's- Okay. Like, where's the- But I will be posting a review tomorrow, so hopefully- you guys will like it. It's going to be a lot better than my older ones. I don't know, like, I have a lot of ideas and some great commentary on the game. You'll see what it is, and... Shit, I don't want to- Shut up! I don't want to talk to you anymore. You fucking pink-haired little slut. Go back to your maid cafe. Jeez. Okay, anyway. So I will leave you guys off. I hope you guys like my review tomorrow. And I hope you're enjoying this series. I'm going to have a new LP up Tuesday, I believe. And then next Saturday, I'm going to have up a new viral game. So I will see you guys later. Have a nice day.